up you guys? It's Pokegirl7 here and today is day one of the bug out event in Pokemon Go. So during this event we're going to have increased bug type spawns and incense is going to last for one hour instead of the usual 30 minutes and Pokemon are going to spawn more frequently from incense. We also have some bug type field research which we're going to go over in today's video and we have a new shiny bug type Pokemon, Scyther. So yes, you can now find a shiny Scyther in the wild and Scyther evolves into Scizor using a metal coat so you can actually get two new shinies technically right now. At the time of filming this video that's the only new bug type shiny that I know about but we might find out about more as we go along. I'm not really sure because the event just started and the only thing that I've seen any confirmation on online is shiny Scyther so I'm pretty excited to go out and hunt that but guys I'll be honest it's not anywhere on my nearby right now so I don't know how hard it's going to actually be to get a shiny Scyther in Pokemon Go but we're definitely going to try to hunt it down and guys also we have a new legendary raid boss coming to Pokemon Go today. Today, origin form Giratina so a bunch is happening today in Pokemon Go it's pretty crazy so I guess let's go ahead and get the video started so not only did we get shiny Scyther in this event but we also have a bunch of bug type Pokemon spawning that can be shiny such as Caterpie and Pinsir so let's go ahead and do a shiny check on Caterpie and no shiny there but this is a great opportunity to get those shiny bugs that have already been released that you haven't got yet so that's kind of like another goal during this event I do have all of the shiny bugs, but I would still like to get multiples of them. Um, I really want to get some more shiny Caterpie so I can finally do my shiny Butterfree evolution. I've never done it yet. I really like to have my shiny Caterpie because when I walk it as my buddy Pokemon, it sits on my shoulder and it's just super cute. So that's why I haven't evolved it yet, but I'm hoping I can maybe pick up one or two more shiny Caterpie maybe during this event. So you just never know. I'm sure we're going to be seeing Caterpie a lot more during this event than any other bug type Pokemon. Like there's one right here. Let's do a shiny check there and no shiny but this is probably going to be the most frequent bug spawn or at least one of them i haven't seen a scyther yet at all not even on my nearby so i don't even know if this event's going to be a shiny scyther hunt it might be more of a shiny caterpie and maybe a shiny pincer hunt but i'm hoping they increase the scyther spawns a little bit look at that guys none on the nearby there is an altered form giratina raid right there i might actually go do that because this is probably going to be the last one i see because origin form giratina is going to be taking its place probably within the next hour or so so maybe we can go do that raid Right now we're kind of waiting for an origin form Giratina raid to show up. There's no raids starting in town right now or at least no legendary raids so I'm not sure if we're actually going to get one of those before the night is over. Raids end for the day in like two hours so I don't know if I'm getting that new Giratina just yet but while we're waiting around let's use an incense and see how good these spawns are. We're supposed to be getting more frequent spawns from incense so let's see how good that really is and it does last an hour right now during this event so that's pretty cool. And guys, I haven't seen a single Scyther still. I don't know what's going on. There's no Scyther in the wild for some reason. It's really weird. I actually said something on Twitter about it. And basically everyone else said they've only seen one or they haven't seen any. So I don't know what's going on. But Scyther is like nowhere to be found. So I really don't think we're going to be getting that shiny Scyther unless they increase the spawns or something like that. It's just weird how they've been doing these events and like they release new shinies but they don't spawn a lot. Like uh, Solrock and Lunatone were really and a lot of people were upset because the spawn rates were so low and it was really hard to get a shiny for those and I think it's even harder to get a shiny Scyther right now so this is really weird guys I'll be honest I've been a little bit bored with Pokemon Go lately and I kind of was hoping this event would be really fun because it would give me something fun to do and something fun to make videos about and guys it's just been boring I'm just gonna be honest with you like I'm really depressed about this event because it's just not what I wanted it to be at all. I was hoping they would release some new shiny bugs and they would be spawning everywhere and it would be fun to shiny hunt. You know, I wanted to do some like shiny hunting live streams. And guys, it's just not happening. I don't know, maybe they'll fix it. Maybe this event like isn't as good as it's supposed to be. Maybe they flipped the wrong switches or something. I don't know, I'm hoping this is just a goof up and they make Scyther spawn a little bit more. I'm sounding a little bit spoiled and entitled, but I don't know, I just feel like Pokemon Go kind of survives off of events and the events have been kind of boring the last couple of times, um, other than Lotad Research Day, so hopefully they fix this bug event, give us some more Scyther spawns, and um, I'm actually not getting another spawn from this incense. I thought it was supposed to be more frequent spawns, but maybe they just meant because it's a one hour incense or something like that, that we're just getting more Pokemon from an incense than usual. I don't really know. Another one hasn't showed up or anything. 
but yeah i guess we're just gonna wait around for an origin form giratina it might show up and we actually have some things to talk about there's some new bug type raid bosses out right now and some new bug type limited research so let's go talk about that so let's start off with the bug type field research tasks so the first task is catch two worm pool and it will give you a caterpie which can actually be shiny so that's a good way to get a shiny caterpie in the game the next task is evolve three bug type pokemon which will give you an Nkata. this is actually the only way to get an Nkata in pokemon go you have to get this task and it doesn't spawn in the wild or anything so that's pretty cool that we have another chance to get that pokemon uh the next task is catch five ladybug or spinnerack and that will give you a yenma yenma actually evolves into yen mega so this is a good way to get a good iv yenma and the next task is catch 10 bug type pokemon and this one actually gives you a scyther so that's like the only good way to get scyther right now in pokemon go and i actually haven't found this task yet since this event started but if you do have this task definitely keep it catch 10 bug types it should be easy right now during this event and you can get a shiny scyther this way so maybe I just need to be looking around town for that task since Scyther isn't really spawning in the wild right now. Maybe like Niantic wanted us to like only do field research for the shiny Scyther. I don't really know. They're just not showing up in the wild right now. Scyther does actually nest. So if you can get on silkroad.com and find a Scyther nest, that would be great. You could go there and hunt the shiny Scyther. But as of now, this is like the best way to hunt it, I guess, at least for me. But those are all of the bug type field research tasks. So there are some new bug type raid bosses and there's actually a Caterpie raid right here which is yet another way to get a shiny Caterpie in Pokemon Go. But let's go over what all of these new raid bosses are. So first off in tier 1 we have Skaroopy, Cricketot, and Caterpie. In tier 2 we have Combee, Pineco, and Masquerain. Tier 3 we have Pinsir, Shuckle, and Scyther. And in tier 4 we have Ninjask. So yes, Scyther is a tier 3 raid boss right now. You can get a shiny that way too. So there's a lot of shiny bug opportunities. I'm really excited about the shiny Pineco in tier two that would be a lot of fun hopefully we can get a shiny pineco i actually forgot about that one but that's one of the shiny bugs that i don't have in the game so that one would be pretty cool so let's do this caterpie raid right here and see if we can get a shiny Okay, it's time for a Caterpie Raid Boss shiny check. Let's go. Let's get that shiny and <laughs> no shiny on that one. But we don't need one. It would just be nice to get another. But let's go see if we can find some other interesting raids around town. And we have found a Pineco raid, so we're going to try to get a shiny Pineco from this one. And I actually just completed a field research task of catching two Wormpool, and this is going to give me a Caterpie. So let's see if we can get a shiny Caterpie from this task and no shiny on that one but let's go ahead and do this pineco raid and hopefully we get that shiny okay we defeated the pineco raid boss now let's do our pineco shiny check and no shiny on that one I don't know what the 100% IV CP is on Pineco, so we could be surprised and get one with really good IVs. I don't know, but I really want to get this shiny. It's so beautiful. I love gold shinies, so we're going to keep trying to get one of these during this event. They're spawning in the wild a lot right now, and they're also spawning from incense, so we actually have a pretty good chance during this event. So unfortunately, no origin form Giratina rates have showed up in town today, but I'm not really too bummed out about it because I know they'll start showing up tomorrow and we have until April 29th to get this new raid boss. So it's totally cool. And if you guys needed to know, um, origin form Giratina is weak to the same moves as altered form Giratina. So we don't really need a new raid guide for this one. Um, it's weak to dark dragon, fairy, ghost, and ice type moves. So just keep that in mind. There's no need for a raid guide. You guys got this. If you've been raided in altered form Giratina, it's basically the same thing. So that's all I have for today's video, guys. Like I said before, I'm a little bit disappointed with this bug type event. It's not really that fun like I was hoping it would be. And like no one is getting shiny Scyther right now. I've only seen like two people get shiny Scyther online. So it's really hard to get. Good luck to all of you guys. Try to do these Scyther raids and these field research tasks because there's like no other way to get shiny scyther right now it's really hard hopefully they increase the scyther rates uh from here on out i don't really know i hope niantic listens to us and does something about it 
it's not the best event, but hopefully it gets better. I guess we'll give Niantic the benefit of the doubt and maybe they'll do something good. But guys, I guess I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this video right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, make sure you smash that like button. Hit subscribe if you're new to the channel to join my Gengar gang. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye!